Betty. Augustine wasn't bluffing, huh? Well, no one here was gonna turn you in to protect themselves. We're Comish. We take care of our own. <laughs> I guess I did the right thing. You imagine what that bitch would have done to me if I'd actually talked? Probably the same thing she did to everyone else in this room when you didn't. Do me a favor and um, tell everybody else that uh, I said uh, thanks for taking one for the team. lose you there. A little concrete in the legs? It's gonna take more than that. Oh. Glad to see fast healing seems to be a part of your new, uh, thing. Uh, speaking of which, um, the craziness with the hands, is that gone? Yeah, I don't know, man. There's no smoking in the longhouse, remember? Right. And I wouldn't want to get in the way of anyone's recovery. Recovery? Hey, Delson, these, these people aren't getting any better. You're dying, man. You don't know that. No, but the doctors who came through here when you were out, they do. And they said that... They said the only way those shards are coming out is the exact same way they went in. What? But that, that was Augustine and her concrete power. Yeah. Then screw it, man. Looks like you and me are going to Seattle and we're gonna go get her. Whoa, 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 wait, what? You think you're just gonna charm her into coming back here with you? Come on, man, I know you took a bump to the head, but you two didn't exactly hit it off last time you were together. Reggie, I did this. And I gotta fix it. No, damn it, Delson, you just got back on your feet. Look, I know you want to help, but the doctors have already said the only- The only way it's getting out is with the same power, I get it. Which means we don't actually need Augustine. We just need her power. <laughs> okay, now you've lost me. I'm a goddamn power sponge, remember? If I got smoke, why can't I get concrete? <laughs> yeah, but what, what if smoke was just a fluke, huh? I mean, think about it, you'd have to go through, a, what, a thousand DUP guys just to get to her? Yeah, probably something like that. I'll explain in the truck. What truck? I don't have a truck, I... That's oh, my truck. Alright, I got this whole thing figured out, okay? We, we hit the town, we load up at the all-you-can-leech conduit power buffet, we maybe swing by the Space Needle, always wanted to see it, and then we're back home to save some lives. You do realize when we hit the town, there's a fair chance the town's gonna... You know, head back. What does that even mean? It means that Seattle has half a million people that aren't exactly thrilled about the bioterrorists that are already there. You think they're gonna welcome you? Wake up, man. Look, don't worry, Dell, all right? We're gonna fix this thing. I'm gonna find you a cure. A cure? Shooting smoke out of your fingertips isn't exactly normal, man. Just because it's not normal doesn't mean that it needs a cure, okay? Van Gogh wasn't normal. Gandhi wasn't normal. Yeah, but people weren't scared of Gandhi, all right? People are afraid of bioterrorists. They're freaks. See, that's pre-programmed bull... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Shit. Great. Huh. 
Well, looks like we're walking the rest of the way. <laughs> Walk? What? Yeah. Where are you going? Hey! Crap, would you look at this? Uh, look, you know, if you're having second thoughts, I completely- Are you kidding me? This is amazing. What? This is destruction. This is self-defense, man. The roadblock was set up to attack them. Yeah, because they're bioterrorists. Well, it didn't stop them, and it's not gonna stop this bad boy either. 